Here are 10 co-op games that you can get the Platinum Trophy on with a friend. This list is made in no particular order. Let's start with number 10. We're starting off with a banger, we're going with Overcooked. Overcooked is a chaotic cooking game that you can play with up to 4 people. I got the Platinum Trophy by playing it with just one other guy because it gets too crazy if you play with more than two. This is one of my favorite co-op games to get the Platinum Trophy on. It's a little bit difficult, but once you get the hang of it, it gets easier. There are three versions and they all have the Platinum Trophy. They are all pretty short to Platinum and have straightforward trophies. Once you finish one of them, you'll find the others to be easy. So go and play this with somebody if you haven't yet. Number 9. A very easy Platinum Trophy to do with a friend is A Way Out. This is a prison escape game and the story is incredible. You and another inmate have to try to escape prison and fight a mutual enemy. It is a reasonably old game so the graphics aren't very good but you'll just have to look past that. You can do this online but it also has couch play. Platinum takes only 8-9 to nine hours and it's very easy because it's mostly related to just finishing the story. Now for a tougher horror game number 8, Resident Evil 5. This horror game is scary if you play it alone but gets way more fun when you play it together. Resident Evil 5 is a bit longer than the other games on this list, taking about 30 hours to Platinum. The game continues the Resident Evil series and was released all the way back in 2009. However, this game will get a remake, so if you don't mind waiting around, we might get an updated version in a year. Number 7. Stranded Deep. I didn't even know this game had a Platinum Trophy. You play as a plane crash survivor stranded somewhere on an island in the Pacific. The game used to be solo, but now you can play with your friends. Platinum Trophy takes about 30 hours and is a 5 out of 10 difficulty, so it won't be easy, but you'll be able to do it. Number 6. Moving Out. This game is made by the same developers that did Overcooked. It's got the same premise. You and your friend are a moving team and have to work together to get everybody moved out. It is also a quite stressful game, but this one takes only 15 hours to Platinum and has a 3 out of 10 difficulty, so it shouldn't be too hard. Number 5. It Takes Two. Many trophy hunters have already played this game. It's a two-player game that I think is designed for couples, but I'm not sure because I'm one of the only trophy hunters who hasn't played this game. It takes around 13 hours and has a 3 out of 10 difficulty, so I'm guessing it's very easy. Number 4. Stardew Valley This game is for the people who can't get enough of playing games with their friends, because this platinum trophy takes over 100 hours. Stardew Valley is a farming simulation role-playing game. Players can interact with NPCs around their town, but also explore caves and mines for items. There are also creatures to combat with. Let me know in the comments if you have played this game already. Now I don't know about you guys, but I don't have very many friends in real life who are trophy hunters. So if you want to play any of these games on the list, drop your PSN down below and let me know what game you want to play and I bet you'll find somebody very soon. Number 3. Minecraft. Yes, another game where you can do exploring and mining. Everybody knows this game, so I won't go into it that much. As for many games on this list, you can do it solo, but it's fun to do with friends if you can. Minecraft was actually my very first Platinum Trophy all the way back in 2013. It got a little bit more challenging in the meantime, but it's still a 35 hour Platinum with only a 3 out of 10 difficulty. Should I Platinum this game again on my new account? Number 2, Among Us. Yes, this game went to PlayStation. This very famous phone game joined PlayStation a little while ago and has a pretty easy Platinum waiting for you. It takes about 10 hours and has a 3 out of 10 difficulty, so why not? The last game on this list is also the most difficult one. I'm talking about Cuphead. Now, I'd actually recommend you do this solo, since it won't be any easier trying to go for the Platinum on this game with a friend, but I find it very impressive if somebody has done this. The game has an 8 out of 10 difficulty and takes about 30 hours to Platinum. Good luck on this one. Back in this video, one week ago we celebrated 100 subscribers and at the moment right now I have over 700 subscribers so I have to thank you guys so much for your support the last few days. It's what keeps me going and why I love doing this so thank you very much. If you're not subscribed yet, please do. Leave a like and let me know in the comments what game you are going to play. I wish you happy hunting.